Hello guys, hello guys, how's it going? In today's video, we're playing some more Sakura Shrine Girls, and welcome to 2020. This is the first episode I'm recording after the new year, I'm pretty sure. Probably not. It's probably not true. But anyways, we're going to be playing some more Sakura Shrine Girls. I can't wait to get through this. And yeah, we'll just start, shall we? Nayako and Kaya left me alone for the rest of the day. Now it's time to head home. I feel so unbelievably tired. Spirits are real, there's another world beyond this one, and I'm some sort of medium? It feels like the foundations I built my life on have been torn down from underneath me. Even as I am just walking along, I swear that the entire world around me looks different. Colors are just a little bit brighter, I see little shimmers of light in the air. And I swear that I'm starting to hear whispers in the wind. Even though this all seems like I'm going insane. This is not exactly unpleasant. I'm looking out towards the coastline. The sun's orange rays shimmer across the water's surface. Is this how I'm going to be seeing things from now on? Sitting in the middle of the two worlds and not really knowing which is which? No, I don't think it'll be that confusing. And they told me that there's no such thing as evil spirits in this world. Well, those twin spirits are kind of mean to Kayo, but I'm sure that there is no malice in their actions. Slowly, I make my way back home and knock on the front door. Oh, now who could it be? Please let me in, Grandpa. Now you sound like a grouch. Did you have the rough first day? It does, it does sometimes happen, Toru. Just let me in, I need to talk. Alright, alright. I heard the lock on the door click. Dinner is already cooking, I can smell it from here. Are you hungry, Sario? I bet you're going to love what I made for night. I'm not really that hungry, sorry. Grandpa. Yeah, what is it? Ooh, we're getting go we're getting things done. I'd like to tell you that I'm sorry. Sorry? What for? I I never thought that I'd any that anything you said was true. <laughs> he gives me a cheesy grin. Your eyes are opening, ain't they? I knew it. You saw them too. You mean Kayo and Nayako? That's right. Those two stray cats were hanging around the shrines. They've been waiting for their priest for quite a while, you know. Strays? Why do you call them that? Well, they're technically not the patron spirits of those shrines yet. That's why you're here. You're going to perform the rites of the ascension for them. Rites of ascension? Don't worry too much about that right now. But that's what you're going to do. It feels like I'm on the edge of a nervous breakdown. I'm sure they've mentioned it sometime today, but they need to host the ascension festival. Then they can become the true spirits of this land. That's where we come in. We come from a long line of priests, mediums, and psychics. I know it's a lot to swallow so quickly, but don't worry. Grandpa is 100% behind you. Right. I think I'd like to go straight to bed today. Take some dinner with you. He says a plate of food into my hands. Try out the cherry tomatoes. Plenty of lemon juice and sea salt for extra zest. Sounds good. Slowly, I walk upstairs with the plate. Wait, the door of my room isn't closed again. Don't tell me that damn cat snuck in there. All right, Nay Nayoko, you can't stay in there. I take a step inside. <laughs> Even I wasn't expecting this. <laughs> well. I it's, it's thumbnail time, I guess. <laughs> so first of all... Wow. <laughs> Second of all... What? <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm not displeased, but still. <laughs> you... You... She's peering up at me from the floor at a very awkward angle. Her alabaster skin is barely contained by her meager outfit. She doesn't really seem that embarrassed either. 
What on earth are you doing? Earth. Oh, oh wait, oops. Your tail wags from side to side. We ain't really there right now. I told you that we slip in and out of worlds all the time. I know that you only arrived here very recently, but you know exactly what I mean. Where are your clothes? Seriously, panties are way too small for this. I can see. No. No. Have to keep my composure. Look, you can't just shut up in my room dressed this way. Okay? She lo just looks at me quizzically. Quizzically. <laughs> I can't talk, I can't read. My door need clothes from not outside. After all, it's just me and you in your room right now. There's nothing wrong with seeing you like this if it's just you, right? Her chest presses up against the wooden floor as she stretches out herself out. It nearly slips out, out of her loosening bra. Wow, this is getting... It went from, like, mildly etchy to, like, up here pretty damn fast. I did not expect this. I'm gonna have to work something out with the YouTube, YouTube thumbnail this time. <laughs> We need to get to know each other too, don't we? I want to know everything about you, Tario. Look, you already brought me your your grandfather's cooking. She smiles happily. I just know that we're going to get along great. This this isn't for you. Her tail droops down. <laughs> oh, oh, it isn't. Can I have a little bit, please? She just sit, sits up. We're all almost slipping off completely. Don't move. Don't move. <laughs> Why not? Just... Just don't, okay? <laughs> I'll give you my dinner as long as you don't move. Okay. I put down the plate on uh, just within her reach. She sniffs it, then turns up her nose. What, is something wrong with it? I don't like tomatoes. Uh, I agree with you there, Nayoko. Like, oh, <laughs> you can have them. Really? I can't help but let out a heavy sigh. Baggers can't be choosers, you know. They can sell. I can only shake my head. Please put some clothes on. What? Don't you like it or something? I thought it was pretty cute. It doesn't have anything to do with how cute you are. Really, though. <laughs> If it's for my own sake, just seeing it like this <laughs> makes my heart race. If I'm not careful, I might end up... Aw, uh, your face is all red. You look really cute like this. I like you even more, Taru. Enough of that already. How am I going to get the rest of this cat in the room? What's this night going to be? I'll go through one more thing, but wow. That was something, you know. That was just, that. That was something. <laughs> like I got a lot of process that. That was like I didn't expect it to get that etchy. At least so soon. But wow, <laughs> that's all the words I got. This is a YouTube series, all right. Hopefully this doesn't get claimed because that's gonna be the thumbnail. <laughs> I have to like do something with it. But wow. That's awesome! <laughs> when I wake up in the morning, Ayako is in my room. But I can't help but notice all the noise downstairs. Ah, uh, there you are, Taru. You're up early today, you know. Seated at the table, uh, Ayako looks up at me. She mumbles th through her food something that sounds like good morning. You didn't tell me that you had a friend staying with you today, Taru. He notices me with his elbow. I said you, you were going to have some luck with ladies once you moved here. Please don't tease me about that. You look really tired, Tara. Did you get much sleep? Not really, no. <laughs> when I tried to go to bed, Nanako ended up sleeping on top of me. Damned cat. <laughs> you see, I like I like her. That is one thing I do. I like Nayoko. That's my favorite character. Although Kayo is... I'm warming up to Kayo more than I did when I first played this game. Personally, Nayoko is always my favorite girl, so I suppose it's part of the job. Well, I can't be mad at her. This job wasn't supposed to be easy after all. Well then, Taru. I hope you're ready for the big day. We're starting our training. But what about school? I already sent them a letter that you ain't feeling well. 
You've got a whole day off to train with Nyoko. It's going to be great, Toru. I haven't shown you the shrine yet. Oh, that's right. You only checked out Kaio's shrine, didn't you? Well, yeah. So it isn't fair that you only got to go to her shrine. All right, all right. There's no need to get mad. Grandpa just grins at me. What a smooth operator we have here. That attitude is going to be more important with your training, Toru. Now hurry up and eat. You're going to have to head out very soon. What do you mean by your? Ain't you coming with? No, no. Nayako cannot be letting everything you need to know. And my back has been acting up again, so, I, so Garfrey Walk isn't really a good idea right now. So I'm going to have to be spending even more time alone with this cat. I guess I'll have to do just, just bear with it. And honestly, I think that's a good setup for next episode. I think that's a really good place to end it off. So I'm going to end it here. <laughs> so if you guys are enjoying this series, episode 5, I think we should probably get around 15 episodes out of this series. Maybe 13, 12 episodes. But I don't see any more than that. But with anyways, with that said, guys, if you enjoyed the video, please make sure to leave a like, subscribe, hit the notification bell to notify future uploads. See you guys all in a different video. Johnny. It's not a game. I'm not a robot.